Today I am going to teach you about uh, Hebrew verbs. That is seven Hebrew root verbs uh, that I am going to teach you. Especially Hebrew verbs are trilateral. Trilateral means that the root consists of three letters. Root meanings, especially if you look at example, shamar, sha, ma, ra. That three letters are there. So that is called as trilateral. So we we add the vowel to that uh, three letters so it get it is a uh, tenses especially uh, uh, perfect imperfect you know imperative this is sham shamara so if you are putting um, kamesh and pata if you are putting kamesh and pata it become uh, it become shamar you know that is perfect you know that is perfect uh, third person masculine singular perfect it will come if you put in the same thing shamara that is a root word shamara so if you are adding um sheva then she honam she more that uh, if you are adding that one that will become imperative so adding the vowel uh, then it changed um the tenses and all that is perfect imperative etc so hebrew root verbs has a conjugated under seven heads what is that seven root heads you no know? verb root so that is a verb root uh, seven verb root in hebrew that is what are they that's we are going to look at now uh, seven verb root so first one i got to show that is a one two three four five six seven seven verb roots okay that's why i have drawn for you seven hebrew verb roots i can write for you here here hebrew verb root okay verb root that is conjugated under seven heads first one second one third one fourth one fifth one sixth one seventh one that um, we call it as uh that seven hebrew words hebrew root words first one is kal form kal kal next one is nifal say with me nifal nifal next one uh, kal nifal p l p i e l p l next one pual P U A L Pual. Next one, he feel. H I P H I L. He feel. Next one, ho fall. Ho fall. Ho fall. Final one, hit pile. <coughs> hit pile. So tell me with me. Kal, Nifal, P A, Pual, he feel, ho fall. Hit pi. These are the seven Hebrew root verbs, and also it also has a seven um, uh, active and passive. Okay, that that the tense also comes. Simple active. First one. Kal is kal form is simple active. Okay, simple active. That is kal form. Nifal form is simple passive. Simple passive. Next one is PL is intensive. Intensive. Intensive active. Pual is intensive passive. Then um, uh, Hofal is he feel Hofal hit pile. He feel is causative active. Okay. That he feel that we are going to look now. He feel is causative active. C a u s a t i v e. Causative active. Then hofal is causative. That is the reason. Causative. Causative. Passive. Then final one is reflex. Reflexive. Reflexive. These are the seven heads of the Hebrew uh, uh, root, kal form, 
Nifal form PL, Pual, Hifil, Ofal, Hitpile. So I will just write for you uh, in that uh, uh, the forms in order. How you write it in Hebrew? Kal, 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 Kal. Nifal. How you write Nifal? Ni. Focus here. You can look at here. Ni. Nif. Nif. Nif al see that formula ni ni she is a specialty nif al nif al pl pl how you write pl p p p and here yell pl okay pl next one pual so how you write firstly pu pu that is kubus pu al pu al next one he feel how you write he feel no original model he 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 shava you should add eel see he feel he he feel where there is a empty you put that shava okay he feel next to the whole fall how you write whole fall ho that shava comes here that's why this is ho ho fall see ho fall next one hit pile hit pile has a hit so that is a special actually you can identify very easily look at this hit hit pile pa it pa it pa el. See that differences now. Now we have written the forms. That is in kal form. Kal form has there is a ka pata is there. Nifal. What is the specialty nifal? Nifal ni is there. Nif al. See this. Nif al. Ni a nifa should be there. That is a format. Okay. When you write the letter. It is it is very easy, okay? Um, when you find out the verbs in the forms, P L P Hirak is there. P L Hirak L Pual so Kubus then Pata U A U A. This is E A E A P A P A Pual. I will I will write a, I will tell you again. Next one he feel so he should be there he. He is there. Then if il if il that is hierarchy all is there. So that is a specialty of he feel. See this e sound hierarchy he feel. Ho ho al ho far a o a sound. Next one hit will be there. Hit hit hit. Pael, that is a format. So how you are going to write now? Apply the verb root, the root in the seven heads. Okay, you, we are applying shamar basically. We are going to take shamar, and in shamar we are going to apply kal form, kal form of shamar, nifal form, pl form, pual form, and uh, he he feel. Hofal hit pile and he feel hofal hit pile. We take gadol, okay? That is for understanding the meaning uh, clearly with this tense, especially simple active, simple passive, intensive active, not to get to the uh, real meaning. In the three section, especially uh, he feel hofal uh, hit pile. We take gadol as the root to it. So, first one we look at to um, the first section. Kal, okay, we are going to apply, which I said shamara, shamar, shamar we are going to write. Kal form, so look at the kal form, shamar, shamar I am going to write. Um, look at here. That is. Sha, ma, shamara. 
shamara look at now sha look at the middle letter ka pata shamar so now here also you can write nifal model of shamar simple passive how you write simple passive of shamar simple passive of shamar root word apply firstly nifal form in nifal form you apply ni then sha shamara apply the shamara there sha ma ra shamara shamar then apply the same vowel so apply shava here sha nif al so here is nish mar nish mar see that nish ba so or maybe nish mar or maybe we can give the other letter also shaba shabara hmm? shabar shabar okay so it is ba it is also changing a little bit shaba that is easy for understanding the meaning okay shabara nish bar nish bar so kal form simple active means he has broken that is the meaning of active nifal pl form that is simple passive so the meaning is he was broken okay next one you are going to add shabara shabar meaning broken okay that is broke broken he has he is broken so shabara is this shabara it is in pl form pl is actually intensive active the meaning will be he has utterly broken that means pl it is intensive intensive active so that is it is he has utterly broken he has utterly broken that is in pl form next one is pl form pl pl how you write pl p l c p p l like that you should write next one is pl so you write root write the root, root letter shabara then apply pu u pu 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 al pual shu a ah, pual pual meaning that is a uh, intensive passive he was this just earlier it was he has utterly broken now he was utterly broken he was utterly broken next one is he feel he feel is look at he feel now he if il he feel so he feel we are going to add the root letter gadol okay gadol in order to get the uh, uh, in order to get the proper meaning we are applying ga gadol okay gadol uh, that is in the kal form meaning is he has great gadol he has great so we are applying gadol here you can apply shamar also no worry shabar also you can apply but for the meaning purpose uh, author has given this meaning so we look into that uh, format uh, shabar so it is in a he feel format so what you should add he feel firstly apply he then what you should apply sha ba ra then what you should apply hirak is hirakyo this is specialty apply hirakyo then put shava in the middle that is if there is if md is there you put is um uh, shava there so hif il so his beer hif il that model his beer look at that hifil model e feel after is he when you when you read his beer you should understand that this is he feel format um the meaning is what is this this is causative active causative causative active if he feel that means there is a reason some reason is a causative active meaning that he there should be reason he has made great he has made great wonderful next one hofal 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 specialty how what you should do 
Firstly, you should apply ho. That is ho you apply it. Okay. Then what you should add? Oh, his beer. Okay. If it is his I told you to gadal. Gadal. Uh, gadal. But I wrote a shabar. Um, sorry. Uh, He has made broken. He has made broken. Or is, uh, if it is a uh, gadal, gadal. So higadil, higadir, higadil will come if it is a gadal. If it is gadal, higadil will come. That is a meaning he has made great. That is a root word. Okay. Here you are applying, I told you gadal. He, ho, this is hofal. So the root letter is ho, you are add, you need to add. Then hok hok dal. See? Hok dal. See where it here you apply? Shava. So the meaning is he this is a passive. What is a passive? Causative passive hofal. So he was um, made great. Then final one, Hitpail. Hitpail is reflexive. Is reflexive. That is very easy to identify. Hit is there. Uh, hit the pile. So if, if before the root hit is there, you can ensure that this is a reflexive. This is hit pile format. So you, how you add? You need to add hit the first, then gadal. Then you apply hit the hit the. Okay. Then hit pile format. Like pa. Pa, a so gai del see hit hit gadel hit gadel meaning is uh, he has made reflexive will coming back to us okay that is reflexive uh, he has made himself himself great very good excellent look at this now. Uh, we have did the seven Hebrew roots. Um, uh, uh, did you understand that? The basic root is Shamara, that is a trilateral. And also it has a seven forms, Kal, Nifal, Piel, Pual, Hifil, Hofal, Hitpail. And uh, Kal is symbol active, Nifal is symbol passive, Piel is intensive active, that means he has utterly broken. Intensive passive, he was utterly broken. Causative active, he was made cause, cause, cause is the reason. No, he has made broken. Who did made? Oh, no, who, who is the reason behind it? He has made, he made broken or he has made great. If it's a gadal, uh, he has made great. Then causative passive is hofal format. Um, that is uh, causative passive. He has, he has made great. And hit pile that is a reflexive. He was may he has made himself that is uh, reflecting to himself that is a reflexive actually, reflecting to him. You know, um, it is himself, herself, myself itself like that. So Carl form. Look at the Carl form. Carl. Nifal form. Ni will be there. Nif ah ni ah. So look at that. ni ah. So when you read nishbar. You can understand that this is which form, this is not Kal form, but Ni is there, A is there, so it is a Nifal format. Look at this one, Shiber, this is not Shabar, so it is Shiber, which form EA, EA sound coming in PL, PA, PL, in PL format it is coming, okay, that's why he was utterly broken, that is intensive. Next one is, Pu. see this, Shubar, U A. U A. See, look at it. Look at it carefully. U A. That is a U A sound is shoe bar. That is pual format. U A pual format. Then he feel. He feel. E e. See this hish beer. He is a specialty here. Then e. He feel. If he is there, belong before the shamar, and also shabar and e sound is coming. That is exactly. This is a he feel format. Then. Uh, look at that. Hagdal. Sorry, sorry. Hogdal. Hof al model. Hof al model. Ho is there. 
eyes are half filled then finally hit pile hit is added pile hit pile is there yes made himself great these are the seven hebrew root is conjugated under seven heads so this is kal nifal pl pual hifil hofal hit pile okay god bless god bless you may the good god bless you to understand these things and to uh, learn the language in evil manner if you like it like it um, you can comment god bless you